Hey, welcome to another episode of Let's See What Happens. We've got a different one for you today, and I'm, I want to try something. Um, I've got a fire extinguisher, and I've always wanted a flamethrower, and I thought what would be the irony of making a flamethrower out of a fire extinguisher. So I'm going to try that. At first, I was going to take, and I've seen people that do this. Actually, my, one of my brothers has done this, uh, to take a valve stem for like a tubeless tire and put it, uh, drill a hole in the fire extinguisher and, and, and put a valve stem in there. And then you can put whatever you want in there and pressurize it and, uh, with, with air. But I don't think I'm going to do it that way. I found that the, uh, this hose comes off fairly easily. You can just unscrew it. All right. And I've got this air attachment. So I can screw that into it, pressurize it, and be good to go. First, I've got to put fuel in here. And uh, then we'll take it outside. And it's dark outside, so we can get full effect of the fire. And it's been raining all day, so it should be a good day to do this. I, I don't need the fire department more upset at me than they already had been. So, um, and if you didn't get that, watch some of my other videos. <laughs> but let's get this started, see what happens, see if we can have some fun with a uh, flamethrower. I'm going to use this little mini torch as, um, I'm going to mount it to the end of the hose as our ignition source. And I'll probably use like a gasoline diesel mixture. And uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, about half and half diesel gasoline mix here. Should have got a funnel for that. It made this job a lot easier. Alrighty, I have the setup here. I got the fire extinguisher, uh, and it is charged up and ready to go. I have a lighter, like a little mini torch, uh, wired to the end of the hose, and the idea is that I'll hold it. I don't know how safe that is, but we'll we'll see what happens. I'll light it up, and it's got a lock on feature. I'll hold it in place while uh, when I when I hit the the lever, and uh, we'll see what happens. I'm curious. I think that the only problem we're gonna have is that it's not gonna last very long because the uh, I can only get so much air pressure in there, so which is why most most uh, actual flamethrowers don't use air pressure; they use a uh, pump. But we'll see what happens, and uh, at least it'll be a working prototype if it works, and then we can work up from there. Let's take her outside and get to the test. Alrighty, here we are, and as you can see in front of my pond, um, I'm gonna kind of do it out over top of the pond, I'm not taking any chances on starting a forest fire here. Um, and then I, if I know it works, I can get a little bit more experimental later on. But here it goes. Let's see what happens. Let me get this thing started. All right, our little mini torch is going. Let's see. Are you about to watch me blow myself up and you're not even subscribed to the channel? Yeah, you. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That was awesome. Let's try that again. <sighs> Woo! Oh, yeah.
That was fantastic. All right. I definitely got to try that again. It didn't last very long. I only got like, I don't know, four or five seconds out of it. Whoo! That was awesome though. Alrighty, here we are to try it again. I've got it refilled, repressurized, and I'm I'm getting a little braver. We're still right next to the pond, but I'm getting a little braver. I'm gonna try it on this grass. It is soaking wet. It's been pouring rain all day, and there's just there's some grounds all swampy, so I'm not expecting it to spread at all. But maybe there's I I did uh, three parts diesel, one part gasoline, so we might get a little bit more of a a longer lasting burn this time. I'm gonna try and see if I can light some stuff on fire. Let's see what happens. Tell you what, that is insanely hot. Insanely hot. Oh, that's awesome. I think I sent some hair. Woo! Yep, I'm going to have to play with this thing some more. I'm going to try and make it easier to fill it. Um, see if I can get this top off. I did not, I was not successful, but I'm going to get, see if I can get it in a vise and get the top off. That'll make it a lot easier to fill. Yeah, that was fun. That was awesome. All right, thanks for watching. That was absolutely fantastic. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please comment. Let me know that you enjoyed it. And I, uh, I hope to be able to do some more stuff like this uh, as we keep going along. If you'd like to see more stuff like this, uh, to see more of this or more stuff like it, let me know. And uh, best thing you can do is if you'd like to watch another one of my videos, again, one should be popping up right, right about here or so. If you'd like to watch another one of my videos, uh, well, I'd love that, and that would that would help me out immensely. Uh, the, uh, if you could subscribe, I'm almost to 100. And remember, as soon as I hit 100, I'm gonna upload that video of uh, blowing up that full size van. And this is nothing compared to that. So, uh, just the usual, I guess. If you could like the video, subscribe, comment, whatever. And if none of the above, that's all right too. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and you'll see me next time.